Hey guys, well, it's time to get another fourth weapon, so let's do it. Alright, so in the last part, we got Xiao Xiao's fourth weapon. This time around, we're gonna get Jiang Wei's fourth weapon. In order to do that, it's gonna go to battle with Jie Ting, play under Shu's forces, and play as Jiang Wei. There we go, let's do it. Okay, so we have gotten a fourth weapon here. We got Wei Yan's fourth weapon here. So, we know how difficult it could be. As for the conditions for uh, Jiang Wei's fourth weapon, it's really not that difficult. Well, it could be if you take too much time, but anyway, uh, we'll talk about that once we start. The intro and the conditions we know, the equipment, the weapon, we have a vapor with additional luck of 2, reach of 5, and defense of 3. The items, the same 5, so there we go, and there we go. The bodyguards, we're going to keep at 8. Alright, let's do it. Way. Isn't this land perfect? It is dangerous. We will lose our path of retreat if we camp on the mountain. Well now, will Masu be capable of success? Jing is the main city of the Shu army. We will build a defense here and wait for General Zhou Yu. You shall not stand in my lord's way. Take a position along the road. Make sure you are not visible from the mountain top. Your lordship, leave it to me. Really? Okay, so the fourth weapon conditions. You have to defeat Zen Ji here, and you have to defeat Cao Zhen. It would be easy if she doesn't shield it up. There you go, she's almost down. Alright, that's one down, and we got one more to go for the fourth weapon. Now we're gonna go for Sao Zhen. Just be very careful, there's so many crossbows here. Yeah, you need to get off your horse. There we go. Really? Alright, he's halfway down. A little more halfway than halfway down, I should say. Okay, sent flying doesn't help either. Hopefully this Musu attack will finish him off. There we go. And that's how you do it. Okay, so now that we defeated those two, we're going to wait for the item to appear, which is a supply unit, not a precious item report. So we got to be careful not to lose it. At the same time, we got to make sure we don't get distracted by all these troops, because they will be a pain in the ass when they try to knock you off your horse. You fool! 
walk to one's own grave. That shoe, General. So stupid. That's probably the thickest thing I ever seen in my entire life playing this game. The only downside if you go charging for his NG and uh, Sal Zhen is you're gonna have to deal with so many troops and officers. It's not even funny. And the chances are extremely high when it comes to dying. I mean, unless you're great at this game. I'm not saying I'm great at this game. I feel like I'm okay. So, this is not gonna be fun. First off, you guys gotta go. Because those crossbows will kill you. I mean, obviously they'll kill you, but they're the worst. Boy, did I need that. Yeah, we'll save that in case if I'm about to die, or if it disappears. Alright, that should take care of him. Or not. Alright, quit. Quit. Sh there we go. I was going to say, quit shielding. Now, Dung Eye. Yikes, that was an accident. Oh, never mind, I thought he was going to shield. Alright, that's another one. Okay, now let's go and rescue Masu. Pitiful fool, you will die. And after that, we got Zhang He, and that's it. Please forgive me for my ignorance. Everyone, I'm sorry for causing you hardship. We shall attack Zen Yi and all of his men. Alright, so we're gonna defeat Shin Pi. I defeated an officer. Shin Pi's down. Also, I forgot to mention about the fourth weapon. If I haven't already, if not, then all this crap is going to be uh, edited out. Uh, you have a set time frame to uh, defeat Zenji and Sao Zhen for some reason. And uh, apparently from what I saw, it was five minutes. So you really need to get really into the battle and defeat those two quickly. Alright, now we're going to defeat Zheng He. Hopefully we don't get killed by him.
Oh, it, there goes all my bodyguards. All right. That should finish him if he doesn't shield. Or if I completely miss the attack. That will finish him. There we go. So we rescued Masu. Uh, if you defeat Shin Pi before he says all that dialogue, yeah, if he says all that dialogue before you defeat Shin Pi, then you have to defeat Zhang He to finish uh, to change the back music to where it was before. However, if you defeat Shin Pi before that happens, then It'll change right then and there. Okay, so now all we have left is Simi Yi. We defeated Simi Zhao, if I'm not mistaken. Did we? No, we didn't. I'm thinking the failed recording. So we'll go back down here and defeat Simi Zhao, then defeat Simi Yi, then finish this battle off. Well, finishing this battle off will be defeating Simi Yi. I mean, we don't have to go for Simba Zhao, but I'm not chancing anything. So I've seen some of the stupid things that happened so far, so... I mean, I've seen really stupid things. Anyway, here's Simba Zhao. Alright, he needs a quick... There we go. Quit shielding! There we go. Really? There we go. Alright, now Simi Yi. Well, we gotta be really careful. When you go for Simi Yi, just be careful because there's a lot more crossbows up there when you're facing Sao Zhen. Alright, so... You know what, first off, let's go to get that gate on the left side. Then we'll take care of the other gates. Yeah, this is probably like my second time going for it just because I actually messed up and defeated Zenji and Sao Zhen a little too late. So yeah, you gotta be careful with that. I mean, I made that mistake, so that's why I'm telling you, you have a time frame to defeat those two. I couldn't find any sites that would tell you the time, but there's only one place I saw it, and I'll put the link in the description. And Five minutes does sound about right. Oh, that's not funny. Masu got killed by random troops. Let's break this pot because they'll have health and then uh go for Simi. -E. We're almost done here. And this is the last fourth weapon for Shu. Okay, we'll secure this gate next. If they don't run away. If they don't run away, there we go. 
Sometimes I hate that nonsense when they run away for endless amount of time. I mean, I've gotten somebody to retreat all the way to the other side of the map at one point. Okay, so he's almost down, as you can see. Well, if you saw the health gauge for the guard cap, uh, not guard captain, gate captain. Alright, that's one gate captain down, and we have one more to go. I'd rather have less troops to deal with while facing Simi. Yeah, that's not happening. And these crossbows obviously gotta go because they'll cause major problems when I face Timmy Yi. You know, let's skip that and go for the guard captain. Wow, gate captain. Because troops are coming out of there, as you can see. So, let's deal with that because it's just going to be endless troops. My dynasty will be built on your death. Yeah, and sometimes crossbows will be out of there. Sometimes. Alright, let's finish this gate captain off. Really? Is that a sick joke? That has to be a sick joke. Alright, finally. I was gonna say, there's no way that guard captain should be shielding like the commander would. I mean, I know I'm playing on hard and that'll happen more often, but it's just obnoxiously, you know, obnoxious. Anyway, let's take out these crossbows, then we'll go for CME. Instead of running away. Yeah, after this Musu attack, we'll break that pot over there. I don't know if you saw it. Then, without getting killed. Because I know I will get killed, knowing my luck. I think I mentioned a story when I was getting the uh, survival guide. Every time I died when getting the survival guide, playing as Fushi, it was just because. Simi Yi's its true Musu attack, and it took my health all the way from halfway to death, and that was not fun. So I want to make sure I'm very, very cautious here. Well, I need to be careful. Anyway, he's down after one hit. If I could get the hit in. And that's a win. Alright, that was probably annoying, but at the end of the day, I've got it done. Okay, let's see how long that took. Alright, 15 and change, not bad. 
Okay, here's the fourth weapon, Glink. Has a Musu Max of 74, Attack of 23, and Luck of 25. More of a meh type of item. Well, weapon. So, yeah. Anyway, the items. No, nothing. I'm not expecting much. <laughs> I mean... I don't know why I'm trying to hope for something good. Meanwhile, everything's at max, except for the Wind Squirrel. I'll probably have that at 20. If not, then so be it. I mean... The Wind Squirrel is a very rare item that, well, it's rare to find, but you can get it. It's just not easy. Alright, we'll save. And there you have it. You've been watching my gaming adventures, and I'll see you for the next part, which will be Shu Shu's fourth weapon. And that will be the last fourth weapon for Waste Forces. So, peace.